Sounds like, why are we drinking? This has nothing to do with me. Well, we drink because it's my birthday. Okay, it's Alex's birthday. So Alex is in charge of the drinking. Yeah. Marshall, you're looking at me like this is Alex my fault. Alex doesn't drink. But wait, just a second. This has something like, it doesn't write the number on it, but it has many plants. Okay. So it's alcohol with plants. Technically vodka is one plant, it's potatoes. It's true. But this has uh, digestive plants and herbs. Are you trying to convince me that this is good for me? Yeah, oh, this is healthy. Cheers, Marcel. <laughs> and yeah, you will like the taste. Okay. Cheers. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Cheers, boys. Cheers. Honestly, that's not bad at all. That's yeah, not bad. It tastes like a cop's medicine that you have when I was a kid. I don't know what it's called, though. Scissorp. Purple drink. It's good, yeah? <laughs> it's not scissorp. It's good, correct? Pour it out. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Ooh, we can test them out. First one of two detox. Really? Too bad. <laughs> Is it your birthday, Marcel? <laughs> we'll be soon. <laughs> right. right, Marcel, I'm in charge of drinking for your birthday, yeah? No. I think we need one more. No, I'm down. I'm down. You know that you need three victories in order to be the champion of the national. That is true. You have to say put all in the line. <laughs> <laughs> Last one. Last one. Last one. Yeah. Last one. To be fair, the bottle's getting very empty very fast. So we've done three quarters of a bottle of liquor in a few minutes. A few minutes in 30 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Cheers, boys. Cheers. 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 To Alex. To Alex. to Alex. to Alex. Thank you. It's very nice. It's getting better and better. No. Better and better. With every shot. One more? No. Your choice. Okay. Time out. Okay. <laughs> we are the best team of men in the whole universe. I think you should all know that. Only one condition. Tell me. If we drink one shot more, your affirmation is true. Only in this situation. One shot more. One shot more. Well, it is your birthday, Alex. You're in charge of the drinking. Let's do it. Let's do it. Bailey, let's go. Marcel. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Let's boost it up. Let's boost it up. Boost it up. Warm it up. Are you zinning as well? I was. Oh, I took my zin as well. The, the smallest one. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'll happily take the smallest one because everyone knows I can drink the biggest one. So give the slightly bigger one to Marcel. Happy birthday, Alex. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Let's go. Booze it up. So one more left. Shut the f up, Christy. Right. Let's finish it. All right, let's go. We need to finish the bottle. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> Nice! Now we're drinking! Now we're drinking! Nice! Why I have the highest? Finish it! No, that's Marcel's, that's Marcel's. Okay. Quick, pick a shot glass, quick. Okay, well, there <laughs> Whole bottle done in a couple minutes. Happy birthday, Alex. Happy birthday, Alex. Ugh. <laughs> Woo! Ooh. You know what's funny? This is my show on my channel. Why am I filming so I'm not in the episode? <laughs> <laughs> Alex, it's your birthday. Start the show. So, Polinka? Uh, Chris, Polinka? Put the Polinka up. No. no. Maybe. No. No. Well, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> Several days later. One test of garbage. Lipids. What do you say? Cholesterol? All gay. The only thing that matters is your testosterone level needs to be as high as humanly possible, like mine is. I'm going to tell you some real science. Your cortisol needs to be as high as possible. I'm very disappointed in my cortisol level. I'm going through a matrix attack. They took all my money. They put us in jail. They're trying to put us in jail again in multiple countries. I'm still only 60% stressed. I'd be much happier if it was off the chart. I'm gonna give up on those massages. Less massages, less relaxing. I'm trying to have the nicotine, the caffeine, you know, the, the you know, get as stressed as possible. And the, the other the other biggest psyop on earth, this is the biggest psyop in the world that people don't know about, so I'm about to bust the whole medical industry. It's even worse than the vaccine garbage. Is blood pressure. They try and convince you that having high blood pressure is bad. 
Imagine your blood flowing through your veins faster and harder. <laughs> oh, excuse me, sir, you got high blood pressure. Yeah, I bet I fucking do. <laughs> Would you rather fight a man with higher blood pressure than normal? His blood pressure is high. It sounds to me like he's supercharged. Yeah. My blood travels at 400 miles an hour. Of course, it's fucking high. I'm not sitting around being lazy. Your blood doesn't do shit, but mope around from place to place like you do. That's why you're a fuck up. I demand to have high blood pressure for the rest of my fucking life. And anyone tries to make me make it go down, I refuse to adhere to. How can that be bad? Your veins are pressurized. Rock hard boners, you know? Do you have a pen and paper? Because I'm about to take you to school. Yeah. Up, up, sorry, do you see any dice on this table? It's because this ain't no fucking game. <laughs> <laughs> decided that I now live inside of a mirrored ball. Okay, I live inside of a mirrored ball and all the envy and hatred of all my enemies who sit at home going, you can't really just be tall and strong and rich and handsome with a big dick and be funny and be famous on the internet and have all these women who love him and drive all these fast cars. It can't be true. He must be a bad person. He's a human trafficker. And send all this negative information. That's me. A negative energy my way. It bounces I'm off. I'm one of them. It bounces off my mirrored ball and it ends up going back to them and hits them deep in the heart. And that's why they seethe with unhappiness because they sit there watching me live this fantastic life. And like, how does he get away with it? He's such a bad guy. How does he get away with it? I'm a good guy. My wife won't set me off, but I'm good. I can't pay the bills. Ah, how does he get away with it? Because I'm a mirrored ball and all the negative energy they send my way bounces back because I'm a master of the seven forms of Aikido. And one day they're gonna accidentally run into me in public and they're gonna be amazed by my brilliance. They're gonna stand there in adoration and they're gonna try very hard. No, I know he looks perfect, but I'm not allowed to think he's perfect. He's a bad person. They're gonna run, run up to me and say, you're a bad guy. I'm gonna grab him by the little scrawny necks, pencil necks in front of their wives. And my wife's gonna look at me with lust. That's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna squeeze their neck. Like, eh, eh, eh. And their wife will start taking her top off. I'm gonna take my pants down. While I'm strangling this fucking retard from Twitter to death. To death with my masterful Aikido. With my ma with my ma with my with my masterful Aikido. For a ritual sacrifice. You need a man of Algerian descent. Right here, buddy. It's only fitting though, really. Yeah, but you can't vote, can you? Don't take the flash on our phone, so I can't see you if you uh, have. Ah, that's the whole point, man. You won't put it. We need more dust. Guys, we need more dust. And roses, of course. You can go to the gardens in it. But the hot balls stuff. What about fucking dick? Take one. No. You can't flash it at us and then not take one. No, Tristan, stop. You think that's Tristan? Tristan's in here. I have an idea. I don't think you're ready for the emotional stress of losing to be in your life. True. Uh, the emotional stress of losing to me at you know in the dark. Because you already can't play greens against me. Let's go. It's got blues and reds and yellows are now darker than before. I'll use dark triad tactics that you've never before seen. Come on, D. Let's do it. For the light. Come. I want you all to know that your souls <laughs> will never be the same after this crushing decimation. Your souls will belong to me. And guess how many souls you have? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well played. Good. Good. Fucking shuffle the card. Doesn't matter who gets what card. Doesn't matter who the number of the card. Let's go. Nothing changes because it is built into the fabric of the universe. It is destiny to destroy you. There is nothing you can do. There is no order in which you can put those cards that will stop destiny. Give me the play. fucking cards. I don't need cards to win. Where are the cards? All right. This has nothing to do with the cards. I'm not the smartest guy. This in the has world, nothing to do with the cards. But I have an cards. idea. Boom. That is the smartest idea I've ever had in my entire life. That is actually the smartest idea I've ever had in my entire life. I still don't know how it is. I could have put a red that. I actually put a red that and in a blue. So make sure you have your chance. Make sure you have your day in the sun. Join Victory Me more so. Well, is officially now bigger than it has ever been. It is now larger than it has ever been at any point in recorded history. It was already huge, and then we went to jail, then we came out and got bigger, and now most people understand that chaos is coming for everyone in 2024 and they need to get some money, they can't sit around and be broke anymore. And the school has beaten a new record, and we are larger than we've ever been. What that means is there are more people learning how to free themselves from the matrix than there have ever been before. So if you're sitting at home and you have not decided to join and learn how to escape from the matrix, you now have more competition than you've ever had. There's more people taking up the spots who are gonna jump into the wormhole to free themselves and you're gonna stay there like a broke peon. We get bigger and bigger and I think the reason for that is because it's actually the only place you can learn things that matter basically in the world. If I were to say to you, go join a school where they're gonna teach you things that matter, you're gonna struggle because all you're gonna end up doing is joining some liberal indoctrination camp, paying a bunch of money, learning a bunch of worthless crap, taking years to do it, get in debt. This is a position and this is a situation where you can sit down and say, I want to be taught the things I need to know to live a life worth living. It's gonna cost you less than a pizza and you can do it from home. For that reason, you continue to grow and it looks like we're gonna be even more monumentally successful than even I had planned. So it's a good day for us. It's a good day for our students, and it's a very bad day for all the losers who have not yet joined.